everyone, and welcome back to this Let's Play Clan Scryer in Total War Warhammer 2. And I was just thinking there before I started what my plan is going to be, and I thought the obvious choice would be annexing this land here to the south. It's a lovely province, it has the ritual resource site. And it sort of unify me into this sort of circle. But I also noticed a very large army that appears to be just watching me from this direction. From a faction that probably does not like me very much. Yeah, we can see here. If you come down to them there, it's a there. Deteriorating. They really do not like me. If we go up to the clan here, they mm. Bow to me, me. They still don't like me, but at least they don't absolutely hate me. I represent council. Yes. The second I attack one of them, the other will probably turn on me. That's the problem. So I'm gonna need to think about this carefully. I need to build up my army anyway. The Skaven are definitely the weaker. Maybe get another army on the go, one to hold and then one to push. Because they're definitely, yeah, like I say, they've moved off. So, hmm. Maybe we should move soon. Some warp stone. New mission. Capture any of the flowing horns, right? Yeah, so it's wanting me to capture here in my missions. Oh, lovely, we got this up. And we got lots of money, so I can get all of them. That's going to help money-wise. That's going to help everything-wise. What should we get in the last slot? It would give us another trade resource. There is lots of buildings we need to think about building. <clears throat> oh, I love how these even even this building provides income for the Skaven. That is glorious. Discover Discoverability of Skaven Undercities plus 30. So does that mean you're basically gonna get caught the map they're gonna know you're there? Reminds me of what I was talking about at the end of the last part. I really wonder how that mechanical works. Ferocious plan. Income from all buildings. We're probably going to want that. Public order building. Well, what's the public order like? Negative four. Yeah, we really need the public order building. Which generates income anyway. And it unlocks the ruthless plan research. So, yeah, we'll get that. It'll give us a bit of money. And give us some public order. Wait, oh. Wait, no. Oh, oh trade resource. Oh. Oh, but negative four. Oh, uh, uh, it's not going to get any better without me building anything to make it better because none of these provide public order. Alright, I want the trade resource. We're going to have to get public order. Order! Order in the court! This is dark omen. Right. We will be able to five turns. I don't want to wait five turns to get. More Giselles and Laratlings. <laughs> this is a walled settlement. They don't appear to have much defending it. Where are my schematics? <coughs> I spent all my money this turn anyway on buildings. So I can't start thinking about that second army yet anyway. A wee bit more food would be good. Maybe raid some lizard men, get some food. It's not ideal. Speed things up, speed things up for me. Is that a Bastilodon I hear down there just making a load of noise? Be quiet, you silly Bastilodon. 
At the start of your turn, have at least 350 warp stone. There's a mission for 2,000 monies. The right of Sotek confirmed by some random. Not too bad about that. Strangulation. Oh, I'm giddy. <coughs> I'm giddy at the thought. I'm tempted to send you out to have a wee scout to see where their army is. More warpstone. Maybe just throw ups on some slaves to maybe absorb some missile damage or something. They're cheap, they're fodder. Weapon strength goes down slightly, melee defense goes up, and attack goes down slightly, and it should give them anti large. But that's really not gonna do much. If I recruit another army, is that gonna give me another yeah, army upkeep? Not good, because we're low on food, but I don't think we've got much of a choice. I think we'll wait till next turn. Any heroes free? No. No heroes. Now, now! Now, now! Make sure we leave half of your movement. Bring you down to here. Engineer of the engineer's actually gonna come out, head further in. This way we forward. I can see he's got two stacks down here. Oh one watches me. I'm gonna need that second army pretty soon. Clan Some slaves. Some slaves. I was hoping to use the other army for defense, but if he's got two. Who uh, a lord. Gracier, sharp teeth. Gives him slightly stuff. Good, uh, good loyalty. And the loyalty appears to be. Oh no, you know, he's higher. Perspective. So, Warlock Master. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like the say, I thought that was campaign movement. 3 to 8, 3 to 8, 3 to 8, 3 to 8, 5 to 10. I don't like having my lord as a mage, though. Starts off with plague. Should we get him? I suppose I don't have any access to mage spellcaster, so it's not too bad. Oh, yeah. Heroes. Let's start getting him. Oh, we can get slingers here. That would be great. I could support them into the other army. Slave slingers. Oh, we put you on... Best inventor. So I could do that actually. Get rid of them. Take two turns. Uh, but I don't have the money. <coughs> oh well. Where are my schematics? Oh well. I need more money. The other option is to attack this guy, then I'll have to advance up this way until we get a peace treaty with him. I'd rather attack here. All tails are mine. He does have some night runner sling, so he does have access to some good units. Because if I knew he was all like slaves, I'd be like, ha, cakewalk. But I don't think he is. I think he does have some competent units in there. Well, I know he definitely has those night runners. But, uh... 
They had encamped. Destroy the factions, vampire cults, mutineers, happy days. Technology, we have the ruthless plan. Let's generate some food. Yay! Ten growth. When did I unlock that? I think I just just, just did. These are going straight down to there. Oh, Captain Movement Range. Oh, there's lots of nice stuff here. Too loyalty for all new recruits, so that's a bit too late. We need that for that. So, yeah, I think we'll come down here, then we'll go for that, then that. So as long as we don't find anything else, but plus one food. We really need that right now. We're losing food every turn. I don't know, the slingers in there. Is that? Oh, we're still a unit short. I suppose we can get another unit of slingers in there next turn. It's for you over here. We stalk, yes, yes. Upgraded. I need to see level 3 before it can get built up. Ooh, lovely. Now we're going to need the public order building. I wish I still had the money for that. But the recruiting needs to come first. I need to expand. We spent enough on buildings so far. I'm using the one that provides food, don't I? No, I'm not. Ooh. So after a while, that would be handy to change to the food one. Is this the one the money one too? No, it's not. Is the food one the money one? No, nope. is there a money one? There is not. Okay, so food. But is there a public order one? There is. Okay. Ruthless plan. What have I missed? This guy's not had any order. Aha! That's why this army's not full. Go in there and increase this mobility. Right, let's end turn. Hopefully that army buggers off in that one because I don't I can't risk coming over here by sea if they're still floating about. Research of technology, 500 monies. Yep, 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 yep. Pop that on there. Yeah, uh, that could wait. Doom decay. Get them. Can't see what he's up to now. More warpstone now, now. More warpstone now, now. See, I don't know if he's got any units like Doom Flares or Rattling Guns. If he does, we're a bit of a predicament. If he doesn't, and he just has those slingers, it's not too bad. I suppose I do have my Doom Rocket. Two turns, I will be able to get more Giselles and Rattling teams. Which I'll port to this army, probably. Let's plan. One turn. Public order should be good here. It's really good here now. Oh, yeah, because the army's there. We've got the vampire or something. Let's just see if anyone new is willing to trade. Demands are. Sacrifices to you are about to experience the hospitality of Karen's car. I am the master. They do quite like me, though, that's good. The vampire coaster train with me. 
I'm strength rank 40. Ugh. That's not ideal. We are quite weak, weak. We need more power projection. Which really means we need these two bits of land here. We need to start getting a recruitment off the charts. And I've got to remember I'm scaven. So a lot of my... Little fly. A lot of my units are quite weak. Which is the exact opposite of my normal playstyle. I like to have very strong, very elite armies. We should be able to afford this this turn. All hail Hornet Rat! Right. Hmm. Got enough money for that. Keep up the recruitment. He's moved one army over here. Okay. I kind of like that, that his armies are split up. Let's see, we've got one army here. I don't know what's in it. Because I would very much like to take out the armies separately. Now, what I may do, do I have the movement for it? I don't, but what I might do is I might be sneaky. And I might move into his territory before I declare war on him. And I might then just attack here, because this city isn't walled. It's level 3. It's going to give him a warlock, engineer, clan rats, knight runner, two scheme slaves. And see here it is mainly clan rats here the army does look slightly weaker it's got slaves and clan rats here without shields then I could have maybe a two-pronged attack here but he'll probably want to move out and attack here or come back down here to try and take here again but then I'll be on the defensive What's this notification? Oh yeah, I want him to stand still, that's fine. I suppose we're in camp just to let the game know I want him to stay there. I suppose technically he would be in camp if he was just having a wee chill there. Or I could just do the two-pronged attack on the horned rat right off the get-go. But then I'd need to siege it for a couple of turns. A right has become available to use again. Oh, it was this one. Okay. I would quite like to use that again. I would very much like to use that again. Yeah, let's swap to the food one. Because our food is getting dangerously low. Swap to the food. That's not going to give me any benefits that I need right now. Let the bell scream, scream. Let the bell scream, scream. Two turns. I want to wait a whole two turns before I go again. Take some rattlings and some gazelles. Upkeep on them is quite high too. I was planning to get that this turn. I really want more of those units. Where are my schematics? Where are my schematics? Got to move out soon. I don't like how there's a lizard main army there on my toe again. Pestilence is already conquered to here. The hissing. So, uh, if he goes to war with pestilence, I can just quickly nip in. Pestilence is bound to have his eye on this. Let's 
keep building up my army strength. I'm gonna hit the economy wall soon though. And not have the money for anything. Good, good. Kill devices Ooh. need test subjects. <laughs> what does he want? A non aggression pact and he's demanding money. My strength rank is now 35, his is 36. I like the sound of that. But I'm guessing that maybe because I've got two provinces. So his army strength, actual troops, may still be stronger on the mirror. Listen to me, me. Listen to me, me. How is this still negative one when I got those two new stances? I don't think this has been taken into account yet. Buildings, technology. Yeah, it's not been taken into account yet. It's so good. This should start this turn. So it should start, like, that should actually be plus three, I think. I think it's just not updated yet. Ah, I don't have the money. Don't have the money. See, the other factions are starting to get progress here. Recruitment costs for Skaven Slaves and Clan Rats. It's not a big deal. They're quite cheap units. If it was upkeep, that'd be a bit better. I'll give us some more timber to sell. But not much more apart from that. Let's then turn again. Hmm, I wish Pestilence would declare war on this guy so he'd send his army south and I can just yum. That would be perfect. Plus for your leadership, tree green builder. That's not bad. <coughs> Add that unit of Ratlins. I'm probably going to swap them over to the other army. If I get a chance, have the one powerful army. I'd rather have the one uber powerful initiating army where I initiate battles and have the secondary army that's reinforcing weaker. And it'll hurt me a bit more if they're the attackers, because they'll probably go for the weaker army and my stronger army will be reinforcing. But on the other hand, yep, when I'm attacking, Bigger yeah, we can drop water. those, swap those over. That'll give me three units of Giselles and two rattling guns in my main army, which will be quite good. Be quite good. We do have two warp fuel. That is now plus three, like I said. Could go into my forbidden workshop. Ickets flayers are best. <laughs> Deadlier explosions, yes, yes. Yeah, that's that. It's gonna come across some food, though. Sales. Passive ability to replenish ammo and munition below eighty percent. Be quite good. That's quite good if you've got water fire floors. I don't have any at the moment. That'll only be effective right off the get go. When they start getting closer, it's not going to be as big a deal. A good flay to die! <laughs> a good flay to die. Oh, the puns! Yeah, I don't have a lot of food. We're just going to wait for now. Comes from the sky. Doom rocket. Yeah, I do have my doom rocket to help me, which will help. Uh, oh, wait, what? I do, yeah, wait. Oh, I scrolled over it. I just seen zero. So I just panicked a wee bit there. Yeah. Right, let's get these units. Let's get these units, then we're going to go. And if I get attacked up the bum by lizard men, I'm going to cry. Now I'm going to have to be really careful as soon as I've got this because every faction is going to be like, ooh. Because everybody wants settlements like that. So 
everyone around me is going to have an extra excuse to want to declare war on me. So I wouldn't be surprised if it quite fast becomes like, oh, they declare war, they declare war, they declare war. And I'm kind of fighting on all three fronts. These guys kind of like me, so I think it'd take longer for them. So hopefully I can sort of norm them up as they declare war, and it's not all at once, but... Yeah, look at this. We're going to be in the negative money-wise when that unit finishes building. So we are going to have to go. That food's positive now, though, so there's that. Now I just need to decide if I want to beeline it for the horned rat. Or leave that second. Which one of these is the walled settlement? I think it's this one here, which is the pain. Which is a pain, because if that was the walled settlement, that'd give me a bit more confidence to go down south. Check the now. What oh, is the walled settlement? See if there's a, is there a unique building here? Something to do with... Or is it just this? Because it does have the strategic location. The importance of the lizard men. This may provide a unique building chain. So I'm guessing it's just a unique building chain for the lizard men. Because that just looks like it's normal. Nestler, yep. Yeah. More warpstone. Now, now! <laughs> so... If I move you in, I'm not going to declare war, I'm just going to move you in. That's to come by water. I wanted you to land, oh you can land there, brilliant. He does have seven loyalty, brilliant. Yeah, good, because I don't want I didn't check that, I don't want this army to run away. Nasty water. Right. <clears throat> In turn. Because his two armies are separate. If I take them out when they're separated, it'll be easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I hope the AI goes into Harkin. You're the one guy I didn't think was going to attack me anytime soon. What are you doing? Okay. My madness is not weakness. Is improving our relations with them. I'll be back in a second. We do still have our non-aggression pack with them. And at least to the my recollection, the AI always cancels the non-aggression before attacking. I think, maybe, in the old ones, maybe. So I don't think he's going to attack me. Triangulation, lovely. Hopefully. He's on his way somewhere, and he's just not asking for military access. It's a pain, that's as close as I can get. But I want to get away from that other army. We'll go swap units this turn. So, slaves are going to move up. They are going to move down. Yep, that's perfect. Generator power low. Generator power low. This is not a bad wee army now for the stage of the game. The and this is a good fodder army. Which is what the scaven are known for. Hey, my money's still okay. Huh. A turn till the frust plus the leadership is finished. That'll be handy for the fight, especially with the slave units.
Then we can go. Nom. That. Easy, quick. Then as long as he does. Well, I suppose it doesn't matter where he goes. Because down here I've got large army. Up here I've got a wall to slow him down. So I can get up and nom. Um, and. Yeah. Campaign movement speed. Sword of Cain has been claimed. The right of doom has been unlocked. Lufar Harkin is still just in camping here. Our relations are improving. We still have our non aggression. Curse my crap. His strength I rank can... is only 69. Mine's is 17. So hopefully he is not planning to attack me up the bum hole. Declare war. Their allies is Eshin. They're allied to Eshin. Oh well, Eshin is not right here. Hmm, undiscovered faction. I can't even remember where Eshin starts. Oh well. Now I can see his army a bit better. That Night Runner with slings is the one really competent unit he had. That should be a simple auto resolve. Cannot reduce the number of uses. Oh wow, so I'm getting six uses of this no matter what. Much suffering pain to be had. Should we fight this battle? Oh wait, this is a par. So I wanna fight this battle, I think. It'll be a big battle, so uh, maybe not. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Device to use, hmm? It's always good to practice. So yeah, maybe we'll fight it at the beginning of the next part. So, I hope you've all enjoyed this. I'll see you all next time, but I think we're going to fight this, just for the fun of it. I'll see you all there. Bye-bye.